guys. Um, I got my Finders Creepers haul in. So I figure we're going to open it up right fast. Um, I've been wanting to order from her for a while some more things and I've just I've been conflicted because I'm really trying not to order anything until the fall but I'm failing miserably so as you guys can tell so let's take a peek in here and she's known as glitter and gore bath on Instagram so here's the inside I really like that color of um, purple paper there Alright, let's put this over here and get them out. Oh, y'all excuse my foot. My leg's in there, but can't be helped. <laughs> okay. Move this out of the way. I'm actually going to sit it right over here because if I get this all over my floor... When Boo comes back from his walk, I'm telling you, he'll he'll have it. All right. So here's the first one, and something in here smells like lemongrass. I didn't really look at the scent descriptions on anything that I got. Um, oh, this one is the Jawbreaker Bath Bomb, and it's in Candy Crush fragrance. So there's the card, little card for it. And look how pretty that is. Look at all of that color on there. Mm, it's kind of perfumey and um, it's a little perfumey and a little sweet. Mm, I like it. I like it a lot. And look at all that color. I really like that. That's pretty. And I am in front of my um, downstairs um, glass door. I hope you guys can see okay. Y'all know I'm in a constant battle with the glare. I'm just, I'm hoping it's not too bad. Here's the next one. Oh, and this is an oldie but a goodie for me. Um, almost every time I order from her, I get one of these. <laughs> so here's the thing for it, and it's poison apple bath bomb melt, and this kind of fizzes when you put it in. So here's its tag. Oh my goodness, it smells good. Mm, it's like, um, the scent is hard to describe, but it's. It's a little spicy smelling. Oh, I don't know. It smells awesome. But here's it. I actually have a demo. One of my first um, demos on this channel was of this. Because it's so cute. I love it. Okay. And I cannot remember what I ordered, y'all. Oh, I remember ordering this one, though. Okay, so this one is the Toil and Trouble Cauldron Bath Bomb. And this has a pendant inside. So here's the label for it. And here it is. Look how cute it is. And it's got like the little nubs for the feet down here orange and black oh and this is spicy mmm it's cinnamony oh it's very cinnamony it smells awesome So this one is the Raining Blood Bath Bomb, and it's scented in Rockstar. And y'all excuse my fingernails. I've been, 
I've been cooking. I have some um, turmeric under my nails. Oh, my little rain cloud. He didn't make it, but that's all right. I'm going to use him anyway. Mm, this is what I'm smelling. This is one of the ones that I'm smelling in there. His little side just didn't make it, but look how cute it is. Okay. Oh, cyanosis. Cyanosis bath bomb. So here, here's the label for it. Blueberry mint fragrance. Mm, it smells good. It's kind of like um, it's a um, a pretty a uh, clean scent. You can see there's a pretty shimmer in there. Big blue and purple lips. Okay. Ah. Ooh, this is coconutty. Oh, that smells good. So this is the Gothic, the Gothicorn <laughs> bath bomb, and it's scented in Fruit Loops and coconut. And I'm a fan of coconut. I really like it. Look how pretty it is. Mm, and you can definitely smell the coconut from this one. Two more, guys. All right. So this one is the Eyeball Bath Bomb, and it's scented in lemongrass and bubblegum. Oh, it smells good. It's not something that I would um, think of putting together, but it, it goes together really well. The the um, the lemongrass is pretty much the first thing that you smell. Mm. And here it is. Big bloodshot eyeball. Is he correct? No. Okay. Look how cool. It's a good sized bath bomb. I'm gonna put it like that so we can watch you guys. And the last balm, I've got one more thing after this balm. This is the one that I'm hoping made it out of any of them. I got my fingers crossed for this. Well, I would have my fingers crossed if I didn't require both my hands here. Because these bombs are coming from Canada in this summer heat, so you never know. Oh, her head's off. That's okay. We gonna use her anyway. Okay, so this one is the Bloody Mary Bath Bomb. And its fragrance, its, um, fragrance is Lord of Misrule. I'm not the biggest fan of that fragrance, but it's okay. I don't care. I got this because of the way it looked. So here's the label. Smells, this this one smells pretty good. This is different than, than the um, Lord and Miss Rule dupe, I guess, that I had smelled before. Mm. This one's not quite as spicy. It's a little sweeter. So here she is. She lost her head, but the rest of her's intact, so that's okay. I'm trying to hold her so you guys can see her all right. <laughs> Look at her face, though. She's got like black tears. Her mascara's running, y'all. <laughs> All right. Let's 
sit her right there. And the last thing that I got, let's see. This is, um, I saw this one, I thought it was pretty cool. So I wanted some of it. This is the, it rubs the lotion on its skin or else it gets the hose again. And it's lotion. Sorry. I should have warned you before I start slapping on it. I like this container. I like the way it looks. Ooh, look how fluffy that is. Mm, it's like a light coconut scent. Oh, I smell lemongrass, but I think it's from this balm sitting right under my nose. Let me sit it down here a second. Look how fluffy it is. Ooh, it feels good. It feels really nice. It's thick. Mm. It's like a fresh, um, it's a really fresh scent. Mm. Oh. It smells good. It's very light. It's a light scented. Let me see here. Um, cocoa seed butter, shea butter, emulsifying wax, stearic acid, grapeseed oil, glycerin, green tea leaf extract. So this looks like it's, just from me looking at the back of it, this looks like it's made from scratch, not, um, not a base. I mean, I guess, I guess it could still be made from a base, but it looks like it's made from scratch, just from reading the back of it. There it is. Mmm, smells good. Alright guys, y'all have a good one.